Chief Inspector Timothy Pomoso says the burning down of the building indicates criminal retaliation against the police and that they have already been issued threats. He said investigation team was organized to investigate the arson while the other investigation team will investigate the explosives found behind West Taraka last month. Well, uh, the team has been already been set up to investigate the burning down of the Taraka police station. Uh, CID officers working around the clock. And then we will also have another police investigation team set up to investigate the recent, you know, the police, you know, conflict of the explosives. That one is still pending and they will happen at West Taraka area. The normal policing operations through the Taraka police station officially ceased during the blaze on Tuesday and will only resume whenever a new police station is being built. As of today, West Saraga police station is closed uh, until and when, I don't know when, we have a new police station there. With investigations currently on, Chief Inspector Pomoso would not disclose more information about the C4 class explosives, but mention a company responsible for the bringing in the explosives. These are all Orica products. Uh, Orica, Orica have customers, clients, they deal with them. So most of these, well, these uh, their clients are these are mining companies. Now we're still working around that. One of, one of them is based in the but I cannot give any deals right now because they're subject to investigation. So. Charles Kekeng, NBC National News, Lee.